Hello friends, it's Max Raid Event Update time. It is that time of the month again. I hope you're all well. My name is Lee, also known as Osiris. And in today's video, we're going to be covering all of the news around the new Max Raid Pokemon that we've got access to this coming month of July. So before we get into this though, we've got a little topic we just need to cover. And just to make sure you guys are aware of this, we covered a little while ago on the channel this Max Raid event uh, which was a Zera Aura event. We could battle Zera Aura, but we couldn't catch it. Now, there was a goal set with this promoted raid from Pokemon saying if at least 1 million trainers defeated Zera Aura in the time frame that it was running, then they would distribute a shiny Zera Aura to everyone in Pokemon Home, which is amazing. So, we can quite happily announce right now, I'm sure most of you are already aware, that the, the the goal was hit, the goal was smashed, you guys did amazing and we are all now able to actually obtain Zero Aura. Now this was um, actually started on Monday the 29th, so earlier this week, but just to make you guys aware, I haven't picked mine up, so what we're going to do here right now is collect my Zero Aura. So we will, um, I'll pull my phone up on the screen so you can actually see what is going on and uh, you want to just go into your Pokemon Home app, and once it is open, you do need the mobile app to actually get this gift. Okay, so you would need to download it to your phone, um, and all you need to do to obtain the gift is trade a Pokemon from Pokemon Sword or Pokemon Shield into Home, or vice versa from Home into Pokemon Sword or Shield, and that will activate the gift. Once you've done that, if you've done the trade just recently, then just close your app down, refresh it, open it up again, and the gift should be there. So you want to hit the little menu button, button at the bottom there, and then go over to Mystery Gifts, and then go to Gift Box, and there should be two gifts in there. So we've got uh, Victory Over Zero Aura 1, Victory Over Zero Aura 2. So I'm assuming that we're going to get the Armorite or gift as well, because if we hit over 2 million trainers beat Zero Aura, then we got the Armorite or as well as kind of an added bonus. So there we go. You can see congratulations. We hit our first target for the number of trainers who defeated Zero Aura in special max raid battles. As a reward, you'll receive a special Zero Aura for your team. So let's claim it. Would you like to give Zero Aura a nickname? No, no, we don't want to do that. Okay, so that's claimed, and then you can see Victory Over Zero Aura 2. This is a code, actually, so we will put this in in a minute, but it says, Congratulations, we hit a further target of number of trainers defeated Zero Aura in max raid battles. As a reward, you'll receive some Armorites. So, um, if we actually hop over to the game, because I'm, I'm assuming this code is going to be the same for each and every trainer. So... Actually, I can't do it now, because if I do it now, then the den will update, and we don't want that. So we'll do that at the end of the video, and hopefully the code works for everyone, and then you can just use this code. Right, getting on to the max raid dens. So last month we had uh, a bunch, we had all of the G-Max Pokemon, it was a great event. Uh, they give away a lot of Dynamax candy and level up candies, but um, that has ended now. So as of yesterday evening it ended and now from today we have a new bunch of pokemon so those new pokemon that we do have access to if we hop over to our trusty source over at Cerebi, the link will be down in the description you can see this event is running from the 30th of june which is today until the 31st of july so it's the entire month of of july this event will be running for and there is a well it's kind of like a steel theme say a rock theme as well uh, going on here so you can see we're starting off pokemon sword uh, you've got uh, your one star raid so if you're very early on in your game and these dens will appear anywhere in the wild area so at any den they have a possibility of spawning and they will only be under a red beam as well so one star we've got qfant uh, steelix meowth Rolly Coley, Rhyhorn, and Onyx. Um, and then the next one's down two star. Again, we've got Qfan, Steelix, Persica, Karkol, uh, Rhyhorn, and Onyx. And then getting down to the more, more interesting ones, which are the three star. Where we've got Copperaja, uh, G Max Copperaja. We've got Steelix, Persica, Colossal, Rhydon, and Onyx. And it doesn't appear as though we get any really special items with these ones either so that's that's kind of interesting 
um, and then the four star again going to be pretty much the same and this is all for Pokemon Shield uh, Sword. Uh, you've got the Copperaja, Steelix, Persica, Colossal, G-Max. So you've got two G-Max here. Uh, Rhyperia, which is quite a nice one to have. Uh, and Onyx again. And again, I'm just looking down, seeing if there's any special items that we're going to get. It doesn't appear so. Maybe in the five star as we come down to the final lot. And that's going to be again Copperaja, Steelix, Persica, Colossal, Ry Rhyperia and the Onyx. So uh, pretty much the same throughout except the evolutions of the the um, Meowth to Persica, uh, Onyx to Steelix and then the Colossal, G-Max and Copperaja. Again I don't see any really special items that are jumping out at me for this one but these are that and then for Shield it looks as though it is exactly the same. So um, that is the event it is like I say running from the 30th today till the 31st of July next month. Um, so I don't know what I feel about that. I think I'm a little bit disappointed because we just had that really crazy um, event to kind of lead us into the Isle of Armor with all of the G-Max Pokemon. And I was kind of expecting some new Pokemon to be kind of given away, especially because we've got access to new Pokemon uh, to be used on the online ladder from tomorrow when the rules update to Series 5. So you, you would think things like Terrakian, Kablaian, uh, Verizian, they'd be a great event to kind of have um, going into um, the, the ranked ladder season Series 5, just because not everyone has access to those Pokemon that are now able to be used online but never mind we don't know what special events we've got coming uh, we've had the zero or event kind of just pop out of nowhere so you never know what else might come along um this month and if anything does um be sure to hit that subscribe button because I will cover any news that we get on these Max Red event dens so um we're coming into the game you can see ah uh, I'm resetting I'm resetting a Lapras den a G Max Lapras den for potentially a Persica. I love Persica, but you know, when you look at it like that, it's not really the same. Okay. So if you want to update your dens, it can be any den, like I say, a promoted den, it needs to be uh, a red one. So you want to come into your game, you want to just come into your menu screen, hit the mystery gift button, and then what you want to do is uh, get wild area news, and then your game will connect to the internet. This is for those of you that have never done this before, want to know how this is done. I'm sure the majority of you are aware of this already. So once your game has connected, uh, your, this message will pop up. You've connected to the, the internet and received the latest updates on the wild area. Time to go look for those Pokemon in those dens. So updated on the 30th of the 6th. So you can come back out of here. And then when you go back into the den, there we go, it's changed, Copper Raja. So that's not so bad, is it? Not so bad. But before we go into the Copper Raja den, I did say I had that mystery gift card. So we'll get those armor right ores. So this is for you guys. This is all over the place, isn't it? Uh, get with code or password, and I will plug this in. I need my phone open, so we'll, uh, we'll get this right now. And um, hopefully, you guys can use the same code. I'm not sure if everyone gets a unique code, so um, if you have already got your code and it has been different, let me know down in the comment section. I'd love to hear. And it, anyone that's already got their Zero Aura, their shiny Zero Aura, do let me know. We'll grab it before the end of this video so you guys can see uh, what it's like in all of its glory. It's going to be a cool Pokemon to have for the collection. Zero Aura is one of those Pokemon that we've never seen too much of, but I do really love it. I love its design. Aesthetically, I think it's an amazing Pokemon. And I think I put this in right. Oh, no, no. BLV9. Too much chatting. Okay, so that should be it. And that should give us the Armorite Ores. Let's see. So it's searching for gift. And then Armorite Ore. I think we only get 10. But 10's, 10's a better gift than nothing, right? It would have been awesome. Because the next goal, it was like 1 million, and then the next goal was like 2 million. You'd have thought, like, give us like 200 armor right That would have been, that would have been incredible. Oh, it's not even 10, it's 8. Okay, well, yeah, that's even worse. But thanks, thanks to everyone for these armor right So that's the, the gift there. And um, what we'll do now is we'll hop in. We'll get ourselves a copper raja 
Uh, we can use Urshifu here. Um, so we'll hop in. Obviously, if you want to um, host raids like this online, get shinies, it's a nice opportunity to try and hunt for these Pokemon with them um, and their shiny forms as well. Uh, Copperaja Steelix has a really nice shiny. Um, so it gives you the opportunity to get these Pokemon if you haven't already got them. Okay, so we beat the Copperaja. All we need to do now is catch this. And it'd be nice to be able to confirm that we've got access to their hidden abilities as well. So, we use a Premier Ball, because we don't have anything else at our disposal. I still need to stock up on Pokeballs. And I definitely need to sit and uh, do a session on the Kramomatic as well. Try and get some of those rare Apricon Balls, which seem incredibly difficult to get. So... I still have got no solid method to uh, to find those those Pokeballs, but uh, I think it's all about the grind with them. Right, we've got Copperaja, so we'll be able to have a look what rewards we get. As I say, there's nothing really that stands out there. We've got the Dynamax Candies, a Guav Berry Stardust, and some TRs there. So that's excellent, and then we can check it out because it's been added to our party. And um, that is the den gone. So happy hunting with all of these new G Max Pokemon that we've got access to. Colossal Copperaja, pretty nice. And then we got Sheer Force, which I believe is not its hidden ability because I think Heavy Metal is its hidden ability. But Sheer Force is probably its better ability. And uh, pretty happy with that. So we'll jump over and grab our Zera Aura. Okay, we've been into Pokemon Home. We've got our mystery gift, and there you can see we've got our shiny Zera Ore in there. So, original trainer from Pokemon Home. It is a shiny, of course. It looks incredible. It's such a nice shiny. Uh, the white and the kind of turquoise blue there. It's got a good uh, IV spread as well, which is great. And obviously, it's signature attack, plasma fist, close combat, blaze kick, and outrage are the moves that it comes with. Hissy nature, but that can be easily adapted with a mint and then we get the classic ribbon as well so that's an amazing event and i'm so happy that i've got this now for my collection so make sure that you guys get into your pokemon home on the app make sure you get these um gifts that are now available and they are running until the 6th of july i believe is the um so yeah so from the 6th of July. So you do not have much time to get this event. So make sure you take this opportunity right now. 6th of July is the deadline for when they're going to stop giving this out. So make sure you hop in and get that right. Well, that about wraps up for today. We've got a bunch of brand new uh, Pokemon to hunt in the promoted raid dens for the next month. I'm hoping that we get uh, another kind of extra event in the meantime, as I say, as we do. If we do, uh, I will cover anything and any updates that we do get on these events. So my friends, have a great day. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you've enjoyed this update video and uh, I'll see you all for another episode very soon. So until then, take care of yourselves and bye-bye.